Good morning and welcome to Premier Marie Center today. First look at a brand new, newly arrived 187 RV. This is the newly updated 2024. So all the updates for the 2024 model season are here, as well as some additions we've made for our standard features like our power tongue jack, which we put on all of our Apex Nanos up front, but also some that uh, this particular owner who just ordered this unit in has also made in terms of choices, and we'll explain those to you. So up front, we have our power jack as mentioned. We've got two 20 pound tanks underneath the cover here. So this particular uh, client who is looking to be off grid occasionally, you do have the standard two 200 watt panel on the roof they have opted for two six volt batteries which depending on sun again depending on what shade you have should allow them to get somewhere in that four to seven days pretty easily and then there's ways to certainly prolong that as well some strategies that we can offer up front standard you've got that three quarter length cap with that massive windshield which really makes a smaller trailer like this feel much bigger than it is especially when you're inside you've got the two front facing led lights here which really help when you're hooking up at night just give you that little bit extra light as we come around the corner, you've got seven and a half feet of storage from one side to the other here. So lots of room. We've got our charge controller. We've got for our solar panel, then we've got a 12 volt charger. So if you do want to bring an electric cooler, you can plug that in there. We've got two USB as well, then our switch for our front lights. And then right as that compartment ends, our awning starts and pretty much runs to the back here. So it gives you a nice big area here to enjoy. So for 2024, we've got the black underside to the awning here, so helpful when it comes to the cleaning elements, so you're not going to see everything there. You've got the LED light strip running the full length here on the 187. Standard, the Apex Nano Series will come with the Lippert Steady Step, so each individual side is adjustable if you've got uneven ground. You're going to have a standard lend-a-hand here, so just something to hold on to uh, that's nice and firm as you come up the ramp here. Standard now for 2024, we do have aluminum wheels. So it was an option previously, now has become a standard. And one uh, feature that a lot of people were asking for and now is here, is uh, some form of cooking. So we've got a griddle standard. The nice thing is it comes with this table as well. So even if you're not necessarily gonna use the griddle all the time, you can definitely pop that table onto the side. Very, very handy just for sitting out uh, in the morning, you know, having your coffee. Gives you a place to sort of mount things. And you've got the hook up there for 120 volt right in the center. So it's a nice way to plug something in or if you want to use an electric cooktop, you could do that there as well. So it's very multi-function, which is great. Your awning is going to come out a full eight feet. So again, going to give you a wonderful area here to gather uh, outside. On the back side, we do have the pre-mount for a Lippert ladder. So you'll see that on the far side here. So that's a standard for 2024 as well. Uh, this customer has opted to take the ladder, so we do keep it in stock. So at least they can access the roof whenever they may want to. You're also going to have on the back a standard hookup for, or pre-wire I should say, for a backup camera. You've got LED lights on the exterior, so nice and bright. And the spare tire mount is dead center on the back. And then you're going to have on the back side as you come around, pretty well all your hookups are here centrally located. We're going to have four oversized jacks on all four corners. We've got our hot water tank here, which will be a six gallon propane and electric option. And should you run them both, you're going to get about 18 gallons per hour. We've got a hot and cold shower here, so nice long wand to it as well. So if you do actually want to have a shower outside and you've got some privacy, you could. But it's great for just rinsing off the feet when you come back from the beach and kind of just keeping things clean. If you bring a dog with you, wonderful as well. Clean them off a little bit. You do have your black tank flush here, so the ability to basically clean out that black tank when you're hooked up to sewer so that uh, you're not having to you know, use as much uh, deodorant in there, but also to just great your sensors are then going to read accurately. You've got city water hookup, should you have it. You've got your black, black and gray hookup and valves just below. 30 amp hookup. The only thing you really need that 30 amp service for is the air conditioning. Everything else could be dumbed down. You could certainly use it on 15 or 20 amp as well. You're going to have the hookup for satellite or cable, should you have it on site. Nicely here on the 187, the exhaust for the furnace is on the back side. So you're not going to have any carbon monoxide kind of mixing there. You've got a very large 50 gallon freshwater tank here. You're going to see the nice big gate valve here underneath. So when you, if you did have to kind of leave Dodge quickly, you can very quickly evacuate that water so you don't have to carry that extra weight with you. And then your fill point here when you come into your provincial or state park is just at that point. As we come back around again, we've got our standard jacks. We're going to also have standard magnetic door holders. So very handy. You're not going to have a door coming down on your head. You're going to have matching windows in the midsection here in your kitchen and your dinette. So you're going to get great cross flow of, uh, of air here as well, especially on those hot days. We'd invite you down to Premier RV Center to come a much closer look at these brand new incoming 187 RVs. 
we will be carrying multiple options so some with the stargazer feature some without but the exterior standard features i just showed you uh, they will all be on all of those units and then you're able to upgrade some of those features like the dual six volt batteries that you just saw here